when wishes come true has one very obvious message be careful what you wish for this is the first segment of the seventh episode of the third season of Rugrats and in this one Angelica is as always mean to the babies so Tommy fed up of this wishes the worst thing ever to happen to Angelica whatever it is and we the viewer know that when Drew um, comes along to pick up Angelica, he leaves at Stu and Dee Dee's house a life-size statue of Angelica, which is a present for Charlotte. And I have to say, it, it's it's interesting. It's an interesting choice. And Stu puts it out in the garden and the babies see it and they think that the worst thing ever has happened to Angelica and that she's turned into stone. And they realise that they can't keep Angelica like this. So they have to try and find a way to get her back. And I'll discuss what happens in a moment with a spoiler warning. Just in case you can't remember what happens or you haven't seen it. But a lot of the episode is just them moving her around on a wagon. And I have to say, why did Chucky need to be in the wagon? Why couldn't they just put her in the wagon without Chucky? I'm not entirely sure what the point of that was. Maybe I missed something. But... They don't really know how to get Angelica back and Tommy begins to realise he shouldn't have wished for such a, a horrible thing. Tommy, to his credit though, when the other babies were like, let's just leave her a stone, Tommy said that she's more than just the bully she is and that there are good qualities to her too and that's really sweet. We don't often see the positive sides of Angelica but occasionally she will help the babies and it's nice that to Tommy was able to see that and acknowledge that and honestly it's very unpredictable I remembered bits of this episode from my childhood but I didn't remember exactly what would happen and I guess I'll discuss now what did happen with Angelica the statue of Angelica so spoilers from now I was actually really shocked because the statue ends up falling over and smashing into a million pieces and I genuinely assumed that you know they'd well, they went off into the kitchen to try and get some cookies, which I thought was a pretty clever thing to do. And I assumed, I had predicted at that point, that Drew would come by, pick up the statue, and Angelica would be with him and walk into the kitchen and everything would be resolved. But no, it, it was a lot more dramatic than that. The statue fell over um, and smashed. And then Angelica did come over and see it and <laughs> screamed and then Drew kind of mimicking his daughter, screamed as well. And I didn't expect it. I thought it was a very unpredictable, very well-written episode with a really important message. Be careful what you wish for. And also, bullies can have some good qualities too, at least as far as Tommy sees. You might have to work very hard to see some good in Angelica, but I guess it is there. But I thought it was a good episode. Very unpredictable, very well-written, very well-animated. The design of the Angelica statue is cool. I mean, it, it's a terrible present idea but it does look good um yeah not a bad episode at all one i remembered in part but not fully and i'm glad i didn't fully remember it because that ending was definitely not what i'd expected <laughs> 